Chapter 2 of Wewin's Bible Stories by Anonymous. This LibriVox recording is in the public domain. Jesus Calms the Tempest. At one time, when Jesus had entered a ship to cross the Sea of Galilee with his disciples, a great storm arose, and the waves nearly covered the little vessel, so that they were apparently in great danger. The apostles were frightened, but Jesus was asleep and the storm did not disturb him. As it grew worse and worse, and the disciples became more and more afraid, they went back to where Jesus lay, and wakened him, crying out, Master, dost thou not care that we perish? When they said this, Jesus arose and spoke to the winds and the sea, saying, Peace, be still. Then at once the wind went down, and the sea became calm, and the hearts of the men were filled with wonder and still greater faith and all, while they said to one another, What manner of man is this, that even the wind and the sea obey him? They had not yet learned that Jesus had power over all things whenever he chose to exercise it. At another time, when the disciples had crossed the Sea of Galilee, expecting that Jesus would join them upon the other side, a storm came up, suddenly as before, and the waters were quickly piled up in great waves, for the lake was narrow and deep, and the storms usually burst in full fury with little warning, doing much harm before there was a chance to escape. At this time the disciples had hard work to row the boat against the wind, and it was tossed about here and there by the waves in the middle of the sea until, toward morning, Jesus went out toward it, walking upon the water. When the disciples saw him coming, they thought it was a spirit and were frightened. But he spoke to them, saying, Be of good cheer, it is I, be not afraid. Then Peter said, Lord, if it be thou, bid me come unto thee on the water. Jesus said, Come. And Peter stepped out upon the water and started toward the master. But his faith was not strong enough. And as he began to sink, he cried, Lord, save me. Jesus stretched out his hand and held him up. O thou of little faith, he said, wherefore didst thou doubt? When Jesus came into the boat, the storm ceased, and soon they reached the shore. Then the disciples worshipped him and said, Of a truth thou art the Son of God. End of chapter 2